Hello everyone, hope you're all doing well and staying safe. If you are new here, welcome, my name is Rana. And if you are a returning viewer, thank you so much for coming back to watch another one of my videos. My friend Rosie from Rosie Papatri has launched um, a planner and I'm so excited to share it with you guys. I can't wait to see it myself. So if you would like to see what her bookbound planner looks like, I hope that you would consider sticking around and subscribing. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so her planner will be available for sale as of Saturday, November 19th. I will have her website in the description box below for you guys. I'm super excited because I have been involved um, from the get-go. She has shown me, um, you know, a few things here and there. So I can't wait to actually see how the planner looks like. So let's take a look at what we have inside. Okay, so we have a freebie um, of some stickers. You guys know how much I love the mini icons. So these are winter vibes. Those are so cute. Okay. We have some journaling cards that you can use as deco inside of your planner. Okay. This one is in French. Histoire sans fin. Hopefully I said that right. <laughs> Okay. Don't try to lessen yourself for the world. Let the world catch up to you. Love that. And that's a quote from Beyonce. Okay. So again, this was kindly sent to me from my friend Rosie uh, to share with you guys because 2023 is coming up. And I know that we're all tr still trying to figure out what our lineup is. So let's take a look at this together. Okay, so the agenda does come wrapped in plastic, so that's a nice added touch. So let me just take this off and I'll be right back. All right, you guys, this is beautiful. So I'm just going to go through a, an overview with you guys. Like I said, I have not seen the agenda myself. Uh, so this is a first impression for me as well. So we have l'agenda, complete undated weekly planner. Okay, so this is equivalent to A5 size. Um, the dimensions are 8.58 by 5.9. So let's take this off. And the cover is a woven linen textured cover. So if I could describe it, it would be, you guys know how much I love the five minute journal. It's kind of the same idea, which I think is just absolutely beautiful. The back does say Rosie Papadri. Okay, so let's uh, take a look inside together. So there are... Okay, so we also have two satin bookmarks as well that are different color. And the paper is a 120 GSM white paper. All right. So we have this planner belongs to, and then we have a quote. I believe there are quotes throughout the planner, which is really nice. So we've got a um, yearly planner, and then it's got the big Y. So absolutely love the aesthetic of this, very minimal, which I love, and it is undated. Now, the benefit to having it as an undated planner is, let's say you don't wanna use it for 2023, that's fine. You can use it for 2024, or you know, let's say you decide that you wanted to start using it in March or February, whatever. You can start using it you know, whenever you like. So that's kind of the nice thing is there's no added pressure. It's not gonna to go to waste. You can use it whenever it makes sense uh, for you to start using it. Okay, so we have a yearly overview, the different months, and then over here on the right hand side, you can write down the important dates for the, you know, for that month. Um, she also does have some stickers that come with the planner as well. So let's just take a look at those stickers together. So for those of you that are like me, I don't like to write with my handwriting because I don't think it's the neatest. So, you know, she does have some stickers that you can purchase with the planner. So it's sort of part of a bundle. Um, so you've got the months on here. So you can just take that off and, you know, place the stickers, um, you know, corresponding to whatever the month is. So I think that'll look nice and neat. Okay. Then we get into the monthly planner. 
So you can put the squares just in the squares over here in the monthly calendar. Okay, love that. I think she really has, you know, spent a lot of time and, and really thought this through. Um, I, I think this is beautiful. So we have monthly planner here on the top. We've got goals, so you can set four goals for the month. Okay, then we have to buy or to pay notes, important dates, and we have a running to-do list for the month as well. So it looks like we have all the monthlies first, and then you've got Saturday and Sunday here, um, you know, on a separate page. Okay. Paper is really thick, beautiful quality. All right, and then we get into the weekly planner. And again, we have a quote. So for the weekly planner, we've got this week, a running to-do list for the week, and we also have a tracker here on the bottom, which is really neat. So if you wanted to track uh, drinking water, exercise, reading, uh, whatever you like, you can do that here. And then we've got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then Saturday, Sunday here on the right-hand side. And then we've got notes and next week. So if you wanted to pre-plan, you can write that there before actually, um, you know, transferring that information onto your week. You can just write it in next week. Okay, so you definitely do have a lot of space for that. So that is pretty much the week. Okay. And then let's see what comes next. So after your weekly planner, let's see what section we have. We have the list section. Okay. So we have contact info. You need this for work, whatever the case may be, you have a spot to write down uh, contact info. We have a space for passwords. Okay. And then we've got lists. So, you know, let's say you wanted to do a list for each month. There's something that you're tracking, um, you know, however you want to use this. It's nice that you have that room. And then we have a notes section with some grid uh, paper. So that's really nice extra space. Here in the back, let's say you're going, you know, into a meeting or something like that. You need some note paper. You have that here in the back. So I think, um, you know, at the end of the day, she really has organized this in a beautiful way. You've got your yearly at the front, you've got your monthly, then you have your weekly uh, contact info. I mean, she really just, you know, she did such an amazing job with this. I think it's beautiful. If you love to plan in a book bound planner, I think this one is beautiful. It's great. Um, it just, it's gorgeous. You know, at the end of the day, the aesthetic of this planner is so beautiful. Now, what I love about this agenda is the fact that it is a hard cover. So, um, you know, you can carry this with you if needed. Now, I know that some of you, um, even though it is a hard cover, you do like to put your notebook or your uh, book bound planner inside of a cover. If that is the case, um, Rosie Papatry does also have a large um, leather agenda cover, which uh, you can put this planner inside of. So let's see how that looks. Okay. So there you go. It fits perfectly. It does have a snap closure as well. So if you did need to, you know, protect your agenda uh, because of the linen material, uh, you don't want it to get dirty. This is an option as well if you wanted to do that. And then you have sort of everything in one place. If you wanted to put sticky notes or documents, you can do that as well. So just kind of wanted to show you that in case you were looking at or you do like to uh, put your bookbound planner inside of a cover. So all in all, you guys, first impressions, I absolutely love this planner. I love the texture, the aesthetic of it. Um, it's so minimal and just so beautiful that um, it's making me think now my 2023 planner lineup. I love the fact that Rosie does have uh, stickers with it as well. Now, when it comes to actually using the stickers, I have been told that... Um, 
Obviously, these ones go in the monthly because they are the months. The medium date dots go in the weekly planner. So if we were to just open this up, you can just put the sticker over here on the side. So you've got them, you know, so it corresponds to the day of the week. When it comes to the small dots, you can use these in the quarterly or I should say in the yearly overview. Okay, so you've got one to 31. So um, you have a section for every month. So you have four months worth. Okay. So you would just put the small dot um, stickers inside of each of the calendars. So that's how you would use the uh, stickers that come with the uh, agenda. So again, uh, this planner is available for purchase uh, starting November 19. Now, although I do have a discount code with Rosie Papatri, uh, discount codes do not apply to the agendas because they will be priced at, um, you know, a really good special price for the holidays. Uh, like I said, you can also get the bundle with the stickers or you can purchase the stickers separately as well. Uh, so that is it for me, you guys. I really hope that you enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my videos, you guys. It really does mean a lot to me. Until next time, take care, guys. Bye-bye.